Yo, what is up guys? It is Bemi Gamer here and in today's video I'll be showing you guys a full guide on how to complete the week four challenges. We did receive a leak again and we'll show you guys everything you guys need to know. But before we start, if you guys are new to this channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys for 1.3k subs and 150,000 total video views. That's insane. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, make sure you guys use my support creator to come in YT in the other shop and let's get right into it. So our first challenge we have today is deal damage with sniper rifles to opponents. You will need to deal 500 damage and some examples of sniper rifles are the hunting rifle, heavy sniper, suppressed sniper, and last but not least, the semi-auto sniper. Now the semi-auto was actually unvaulted in the last patch and it comes in a common variant. So I suggest if you guys find it, you use it because it's the most common sniper you will see. And you will also receive 5 battle stars from completing this challenge. Our next challenge has 3 stages to it. Our first stage is to dance inside a holographic tomato head. Now, the holographic tomato head is located at Mega Mall on top of the Pizza Pit building. In order to complete this challenge, you would have to build to it and start dancing, which then you would receive one battle star. Our next stage is to dance inside a holographic Durr Burger head. The holographic Durr Burger head is located at Neo Tilted on top of the Durr Burger building. Now, in order to complete this challenge, I suggest you guys go to the top floor of the building just so it's easier and you don't waste mats from building from the ground up. And you will receive two battle stars from completing this stage. Our last stage is to dance on top of a giant dumpling head. Now the dumpling head is located at Lucky Landing at one of the sushi restaurants. All you have to do is dance and you should complete this challenge. Our next challenge is to get eliminations with a legendary weapon. You'll need to get three eliminations and my best suggestion is you guys go to Team Rumble because legendary weapons are pretty hard to find in public games but in Team Rumble there's a lot of supply drops so you guys can probably find it easier. The good thing about this challenge is you will receive 10 battle stars so that is pretty good and it is worth getting. Our next challenge is to destroy a loot carrier in different matches. You'll need to destroy three loot carriers and these hotspot loot carriers are located in different places basically if you have noticed on the map every game there's that one main location that has like the font color yellow now that location is where you would want to go because it carries loot carriers all you have to do is find them in the air and then shoot them twice and they should break and you will see five battle stars from completing this challenge now before we head on to the next challenge if you guys are seeing this please be sure to give it a like let's try and get 15 likes that would be amazing but yeah thank you guys for sticking around next challenge has five stages to it number one is land at polar peak number two land at lazy lagoon number three land at salty springs number four land at the block and number five land at lonely lodge in total you guys should get five battle stars from completing all these stages our next challenge is to eliminate opponents in haunted hills or dusty divot basically i suggest you guys go to haunted hills first for this challenge because there's usually vehicles in like junk junction where you can easily rotate to after you get a vehicle just try and avoid as many people as you can and make your way to dusty i suggest you guys don't go into team rumble for this one because the circle is super duper fast and you guys probably won't be able to complete this challenge our next challenge and our final challenge is to visit different name locations in a single match you need to visit five name locations and i suggest you guys go to salty springs first because they do have quad crashers on that truck near that brick house and it is somewhat in the middle of the map after that all you guys need to do is rotate to different areas and you should receive 10 battle stars for completing this challenge. So I suggest you guys go to solo for this one. It's the easiest thing. All you have to do is just grab a vehicle and just rotate everywhere. But that's all we have for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to give it a like and subscribe. Again, I want to thank you guys so much for 1.3k subs and 150,000 total views. It means a lot. Be sure you guys go watch my last video. It's about a new leaked gun and it's doing super duper good. If you guys already watched it, thank you guys for that. But yeah, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Too many thoughts on my mind. I can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help. I